Welcome to a Mode, a platform where young ladies come to get motivated. Undergoing through some tough changes in life? Don't know how to cope with them? How to handle them? Don't worry. Today we shall discuss 13 Tips for Thriving Life Transitions As we go through our journey in life, we all go through some major life transitions from time to time. Whether it's moving out on your own, starting a family, or preparing for retirement, these transitions have a major impact on our lives. Going through major life changes without the right mindset can lead to anxiety which can prevent you from enjoying the experience. It is important to have a positive mindset to go through it. We need time to adjust, no matter the life event we're going through. To help the process along and maintain our mental health, we can try a few of the following strategies. 1. Have faith in the process. When you have no idea what lies ahead, it's best to just trust yourself and the process. Eventually, everything will fall in place, and worrying about the present may hinder you from enjoying the journey. Take every hurdle as a learning moment and a chance to better yourself so as to be ready for what the future has in store. 2. Acknowledge that things are changing. Sometimes we get so caught up in fighting the change that we put off actually dealing with it. Denial is a powerful force, and it protects us in many ways. However, stepping outside of it and admitting that things are changing, and it is okay, can be less stressful than putting it off. 3. Picture positive outcomes. We naturally tend to think of the worst-case scenario so as to prepare ourselves for fight or flight. However, when experiencing major life changes, try to let go of this instinct and instead picture a positive future. 4. Make a plan. As we work through a major life shift, it's a good idea to become more organized. Rather than saying, I'll take it as it comes or we'll see how we'll handle this, which increases the amount of uncertainty. Make the intentions more specific by adding an actual time to it. For example, if you are moving out you can start with your bank balance, see how much money you already have, analyze your income and expenses. Figure out if you can share your apartment with a roommate to cut cost or you can manage without a roommate. If you can cook and do your own laundry. Analyzing and working towards it decreases the changes of uncertainty. Suddenly, what seems like a major life event now becomes a manageable set of actions. 5. Continue with work as usual. Major life changes brings everything to a standstill. It's easy to forego our daily activities and pay all our attention to it. The more changes that are happening, the more important it is to stick to your regular schedule as much as possible. Having some things that stay the same, like walking the dog every morning at 7 a.m., gives us an anchor. An anchor is a reminder that some things are still the same, and it gives your brain a little bit of a rest. Sometimes when you are going through a lot of change, it helps to write down your routine and check it off as you go. It's one less thing for your brain to have to hold inside. It's good to keep busy while going through different experiences. This will help you cope with the situation better and appreciate your capabilities. 6. Take things slow. As it is any major life changes are overwhelming. If you need to take time off, you should do so as you can have time to prepare yourself. Maintain a day planner so as to know that you need to accomplish at the end of the day. Many a times, a change takes considerable focus like planning a wedding, negotiating a new job, or starting a business, for example. It may seem prudent to PUSH ourselves into overdrive during these times, but our brain really needs breaks throughout the day to run most efficiently. It's good to include short breaks like 15-minute bursts for short naps, structured daydreaming, and doodling. These short creative bursts for your brain can jumpstart your ability to navigate major change.
what happens is when you're focused. You are essentially collecting the different pieces of the puzzle with your mind, but unfocused time is the time you give to your mind to get these puzzle pieces together. If you're going through a change with just continuous focus throughout the day, you are not giving your brain a chance to put these puzzle pieces together. 7. Take care of yourself. Often with major life changes, self-care goes right out the window. Self-care is an old standard, but an important one. Don't forget the importance of self-care, including maintaining a regular schedule, eating healthy, sleeping enough, and exercising. Having healthy, nutritious, and balanced meal, which has all food group, is essential to health. Besides food, 8 to 9 hours of uninterrupted deep sleep, regular exercise, for at least 30 minutes for 4 to 5 days a week, takes care of basics to maintain a healthy body. It can help to choose one thing each and every day that you do just for you and your own well-being such as exercise, meditation, or journaling. 8. Seek help and support. Reach out for help when you need it whether that's a trusted loved one who can lend an ear or a shoulder to cry on, or a mental health professional who will support you through any major life transition. Maintaining a healthy, wide circle of friends, family, neighbors and colleagues helps in terms of coping with difficult time. It's okay to seek help, guidance, when times are uncertain. No one gets through life alone. Chances are that they are happy to help if you need them. It's also a sign that you know yourself well enough to realize you need some assistance. 9. Vent, but to an extent. Having a support group to whom you can vent can be helpful, but to a point. If you and your support group are solely venting, that feeling of frustration can be contagious. Try gearing the conversation toward action. What can you do to make things better? When people brainstorm together, their creativity and hopefulness can be contagious as well. 10. Realize that even good change can cause stress. Sometimes when people go through a positive life change, such as graduating or having a baby, they still feel a great deal of stress or even dread. Keep in mind that positive change can create stress just like not-so-positive change. Stress is just your body's way of reacting to change. It's okay to feel stressed even when something good has happened and it's in fact normal. 11. Back away from social media. When you go through change, you may gravitate towards social media. Maybe posting to your friends on what is going on in your life. First, make sure you are in a calm state when you post and keep in mind that whatever you post never really disappears. If you are comparing your life to your friends' lives on social media, remember that most people post only the best things of life. Fancy clothes, beautiful homes, lavish vacations, but not the stressful moments. This can give you a skewed view that everyone else's lives are going just fine. Everyone has battles they are fighting, it's just different battles with different people. Step away from social media if you are starting to compare your life to others. 12. Write down the positives that have come from this change. Maybe due to this change in your life you have met new people. Maybe you started practicing healthier habits. Maybe you became more politically active. Maybe you became more assertive. Maybe the change helped you prioritize what is most important in your life. Change presents us with the opportunity to grow, and it's important to acknowledge how things have become better as a result. 13. And give yourself a break. In a time of change, you may feel a little out of control. You may feel like you are not living up to your expectations for yourself. Remember that you are allowed to do less than what is humanly possible. Nothing says you have to function at 100% all the time. People make mistakes, and it's one of the great things about being human. It's learning from the mistakes that really counts. 
If there are no mistakes, only good stories for later. Make a point to incorporate more laughter and fun into your life and that makes you feel good. Thus we can say that the only constant in life is change. It is inevitable. It can lead to beautiful opportunities, even when they come from the deepest wells of pain and loss. Make the best of it. It can lead to beautiful opportunities even if the change is very difficult to cope. When we greet uncertainty and the unknown with self-care, self-love, and support, we have a much better chance of maintaining our mental health during major life changes and finding our way to a future that holds many new adventures. Comment below and let us know how do you cope with life transitions. Are there any other points which we have missed? Let us know. Thank you for watching Ola Mode. Until next time. Bye.